Yo, what's up? It's Alan back with another video. I've been gone for a while, and basically, just because I wasn't playing Fortnite, but I'm starting to play Fortnite again, so you'll see more uploads soon, hopefully. So yeah, anyways, let's get to three takes. Alright, for the first retake, what we're going to do, also, if you find my mic sounds different, it, it is, I got a different headset, so it should sound a bit better now, but anyways, what we're going to start off is our regular triple edit, protective walls, edit through just like that, after you do this move, you're going to jump out, place a ramp, and then after you place that ramp, it's going to be right there, you're going to place two cones, and then walls to catch yourself, it's all in one motion, it's Ramp, cone, cone, walls, and then stairs. Catch yourself. You can't really do it in slow mo, but it kind of looks like this. Jumping out, stair, cone, cone, wall, walls, stairs to catch yourself. And then place a wall here. What you're going to do here is edit out this wall, protect yourself with all these, edit out this cone, and then here from this move, you're going to reset, please control your opponent in this box. But yeah, that's the first move. Let's go to the second. Alright, for a second retake, this one's going to be a bit more flashy. What we're going to do is start off with cone, edit the cone, or quadruple edit, edit out, just like that. Put a stair and a cone again, edit this cone just like this. And what you're going to do here is you're going to throw a full cone, so you're going to jump, throw the walls, and in the jump, you should get the walls, the top walls too, and then cone it, so all these walls. And then once you're in that, you're going to move in this way this jump like that and since you still have momentum what you're going to do after that you're going to edit this cone both tiles right here and then jump again while going this way and you'll be looking up just like this and you're going to get both cones the top and the bottom you get your walls and then you're going to look down edit the cone place the floor and cone above you like that and then instead of going out this way we're going to go this way so we're going to edit through place the wall Place a cone, reset this cone, and then make it this way. Protect yourself walls, edit out, edit out, jump out, wall, a stair, put a wall here, and I'm gonna edit out this hole in the wall, and cone them just like that. You can edit the cone, whatever to it. If you want to be flashier, you can sometimes throw off the opponent. If you want to get a cone here, you can too. I didn't do that. Basically what I'm going to do from here is just literally just jump up with walls and then catch myself with a stair. Up below my head, then I'll sometimes play some floor and stuff. Edit through, please control your opponent. But yeah, that's the second retake, let's go to the third. Alright, for the third and final retake, this is going to be a short one, but this one actually throws off opponents a lot, I find. I started using it right before I took a big break from Fortnite, but I haven't hit any clips with it yet, but I'm very close to. Hopefully I can, but uh, basically you're going to start off your regular triple edit with protective walls, just like normal. Head out, and then you're going to place your stair cone, protect yourself, edit this if you want. And, but you're just going to put a cone over here, and you're going to place your walls and your stairs whatever like you normally do or and stuff but you're gonna want this part added here and you hold a wall out here when you're doing this so basically every opponent just thinks you're gonna go on this and triple edit out like regular but instead you stop here edit out edit out cone them and they'll be standing on top of your cone trying to predict where you're going next so they'll usually expect you to come out this side so it'll be on top of your cone, basically, up right here. And they'll be trying to predict your you like this, so they're not going to be facing you. And you're going to edit out right here. You're going to be able to jump and catch the opponent off guard. Very often, I find. 
find when I do this move. So we're gonna be down here at the get a jump shot on. I find that move actually pretty effective if I had better aim. But I'll be able to hit close to this soon. But yeah. Alright, that's it for the video. Thanks for watching. Hopefully I'm gonna be uploading more often. I can't say I am definitely, but hopefully I do. So anyways, hope you enjoyed the video. See ya.